As a sophomore, I'm looking forward to our competitive practice that we have every day. Uh, as a sophomore, I'm looking forward to a great season as a team. You know, we're all looking forward to, to for the first practice and get it going. What I have learned from Denzel, being with him after a year, I think he's a great guy. He's a good guy to be around. He, he's a good teammate and he's funny too. I appreciate that. What have I learned from Yannick with him being from Cameroon? Uh, just never, you can never take anything for granted. Uh, yeah, he's talked to me about, about eating snakes and rats and monkeys. Uh, I doubt that I, will, that I will experience that, but his experience was good enough for both of us. So I think Denzel's gonna come out and play. I think he's ready to play. He gotten so much better since last season. I think he's gonna, he's gonna come out really hot. Appreciate it. What are they gonna be impressed with Yannick about? Uh, the thing that I, they're gonna be most impressed with Yannick about is just how active he is uh, on the boards and on defense. Uh, he's just very, very mobile and very aggressive. Yannick, well, Yannick has never dunked. Actually, I'm glad you brought this up. He actually tried this yesterday. And you wanna know what happened? It was like this. <laughs> That's what happened. I just threw it. I mean, I don't know about that, but whatever make my boy happy. I haven't, but if the time comes, I get the opportunity, it'll happen. What do I enjoy dunking in our practice? I don't knee, I don't know. Definitely knee. You and knee no, all the no, I mean I mean not really like knee. It's like whoever is there, it doesn't really matter. Like I dunked on people before, so for me it's not really that much of a great deal to dunk on someone as long as I get the basket. But I don't really enjoy particularly dunking on someone. I would I would love to win a game by shooting the ball over the backboard uh, from standing out of bounds uh, to win the game. Uh, Ray likes to say I really don't give a darn about, about stuff all the time. Every time when he doesn't want to do something or he's trying to be lazy about something and he just starts saying I don't give a darn, like he will repeat it over and over again. And I think it's for me it's funny because every time he said it I feel like repeating him after that so saying what he just said. This is Ray Cowles. I mean, he, he, he can do it himself right here because I like when he says, every time he says I just have to repeat it after him, every time he said it. So, like when somebody says, Ray, uh, as a team we have to do this, and Ray says, Yannick, I really don't give a dang. I really don't give a dang. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not really in practice. It's just something that General. you know, it doesn't really matter. Somebody tries to rush you or if you're trying to move and you know just live your way of life the way you want to live it, and somebody comes and interrupts that way of life, sometimes you just got to give them a, I don't give a dang. <laughs> and then you just leave it like that. It's going to be a great year. It's going to be a memorable year. Come out and support. Hope to see you all there.